Welcome back everybody. So, bit of an emotional one this one. This will be the last video I have ever do on my Ripple Power Coronet Herald before it goes off to its new home. So it's got a piece of sported beach here and we're just going to make a mortise on the bottom. Now we're going to use the mid-size finisher from Easy Wood Tools just to get it round to shape. And there's the mid-size rougher, just taking down the sides and making them flat. And then using it to flatten off the bottom, just undercutting it a bit. And now we're going to use the detailer to define where we're going to put the mortise. And use the number one hollower to hollow it out. And the rougher to flatten out the base. and the detailer so it matches the dovetails of the jaws. Yeah, I've already done most of the sanding so you just see in the 240 grit here. Going to clean off the grain with some methylated spirits or denatured alcohol. And now we're going to give it some colour. We're going to start off with some red spirit stain. And then go to some orange and then finally some yellow. Seal them stains in with some acrylic sanding sealer. And then go over it with some microcrystalline wax. So rub it all over, give it some nice even coverage. There you go, so you buff it in nicely, turn the lathe up to about 1000 to 1200 and you buff it in. There you go. Now we're going to use the mid-size rougher just to flatten off the top.
And I was just marking out how big the gap needs to be for the insert. Going with the detailer, just so we know where the uh, the potpourri lid will go. And going with the number one hollower, just take away some uh, excess wood there. And the mid-size rougher, just to give it a little ledge to sit on, so it doesn't fall straight through. You see I went a little bit wide there, so a bit more needs to be taken off the top. There we go. Actually worked out better because I've much preferred the final shape. Gave it more of a domed effect. Okay, we're going to sand again to 240. Stain the top yellow so it matches the sides. And get the hollow in with the number one hollower. So this here is the number three mid-size hollower. They're just checking the wall thickness. And doing a bit of sanding on the inside. And cleaning the dust up with some methylated spirits or denatured alcohol. Some sanding sealer. Um, Yorkshire Grips from Easywood Tools. There'll be links down in the description as to where you can get that. Keep buffing it in until you uh, get a clean paper towel and uh, you've got the equivalent of a thousand grip. And there you go. Please remember to like and subscribe. And I'll see you on the next one. Thank you very much. Bye bye for now.